I wanted to make this comment about the Lavender and Red series. Um, I'm getting requests from youth study groups for more referencing information. And I need to get out on the web that I had handed in early drafts of articles footnoted. This is a series of about 115 articles on at workers.org. And it was a mistake on my part to footnote them. I was new at this, and I didn't understand that editorial referencing standards are different for a weekly newspaper than for books in the academy. So it made more work for those who had to strip the footnoted material and coding for newspaper production. And once the material was cut or moved around after going through final stages, the material wasn't always in the same sequence. In at least one early article, the footnotes were cut, but the book that the facts were from was not referenced. That was just a flat-out error, not political or journalistic disrespect. If you read the Lavender and Red series, you'll see that I reference political opponents. The strength of the four-year-long running series draws more on more than a century of collective revolutionary science and struggle. The errors and the weaknesses are all my own. I kept series notes in order to footnote the Lavender and Red articles online, and I had hoped to meet with and talk to some of the historians who are quoted about doing interviews with them about their research, to allow them to summarize and generalize in their own words. But when I was pulled under by illness like an undertow, and I haven't surfaced yet, at this time my boxes of notes and other reference material my entire library of books is packed in storage and has the dust of several years on it. As I grew more and more ill, I had to prioritize referencing the facts in lavender and red that were most in battle, the most needed at this historical moment, I thought. And so the references for the Cuba book are all sourced using a book style for the segment of this series. If I'm well enough, I hope to soon complete a bibliography of all the books used in the Lavender and Red series, and any offers of help would be greatly appreciated.